What is going on, guys? It is Austin FFA or Luna here. So it's been quite the long time since I've done one of these. You guys have been waiting a long time for the weed stories. So it's been like a month, a long month, and uh, I'm here to bring you guys a good one. So this is about the time police found my weed, and uh, I. this is just crazy, the fact that this happened. So I'm just going to jump right into it. This took place last year, the beginning of high school, and, uh, you know, I was fucking such a nervous wreck when I would I would always buy weed in school because I'm an idiot so this one in particular day I bought weed and it was a Thursday okay it was a Thursday that's how good I remember this I know the exact day and you know I got the whole day filled with paranoia scared about how a teacher was gonna smell it or something so I get through the whole day and I get on the bus at the end of the day okay and um the bus was really just like my I looked forward to it the most of school because I would just kick back and listen to music so, you know, I'm listening to music, and uh, I'm on the bus, thinking I'm in the clear, you know. So, you know, in the in the position that I sit in on the bus, I have my phone in my lap, and I listen to music, and then I put my knees up on the seat in front of me, and I lean back. Now, when I lean back, my jeans would always be in an angle where anything could fall out of my pocket. So, uh, I'm sure you guys can guess what comes next. I'm sitting in this position, looking out the window, not realizing that my weed falls out of my pocket, slips out, and hits the floor. I didn't know, and uh, the, the material of bag it was, it wasn't slippery, so it wouldn't slide around while we drove, but I didn't know, so you know, I got up, and uh, my stop came along, so I got up, I got out of the bus, and I went to my backyard to smoke, and uh, I reached in my pocket, and I realized, oh, like, my pot's not there, what am I gonna do, so you know, I'm sitting here, and I'm kind of freaking out at this point, you know, I'm like, oh, it's okay, I just, I just put it in my shoe or something, I look in my shoe, not there. Look in my backpack, not there. Look in every, I look in my phone case, not there. I'm like, great, great, Austin, you fucking idiot. So, you know, I'm scared at this point. I'm just like, oh, God, what am I going to do? So, I called up my friend who uh, goes on this bus, too. And I'm like, I called him, and I'm like, yo, is my weed on that bus? He's like, no, I'm not looking for your weed, dude. They're going to yell at me if I stand up. I'm like, can you please help me? He's like, no, dude, I'm not, I'm not taking the fall for this. I'm like, fuck you, and I hung up. Because, you know, I'm not talking to that dick anymore. He could have helped me so much in this situation, but hey. So, at this point, I'm thinking, I'm so fucked. Everyone's going to get off that bus. They're going to clean it, and they're going to see my weed, and I'm going to get fucked. So, you know, they cleaned up the bus, obviously. You know, everyone gets off. They probably cleaned up the bus. And uh, I come on the next day. The next day's a Friday. I get on. I'm like, I'm a nervous wreck. I'm like, oh, my God. I am so scared. So, I get on the bus. I go to the back, and I immediately look for my weed, and it's not there. So, obviously, they took it, and I'm like, oh, my God. They're going to know. So, you know, I'm sitting there, I have my headphones off the whole ride there to my school, and I, I keep listening to the bus driver's convos, and then they're, they're not talking, and uh, when they did talk, they were laughing about jokes, so, you know, I figured, I'm like, hey, maybe they just picked it up, threw it out, and didn't say anything about it, because, you know, these ladies are pretty chill, they usually, they, they like me, and, you know, that was my Skype going off, but, you know, they like me, and uh, they usually wouldn't do something like this, so, I'm like, hey, they're chill, we're good, so, you know, I'm thinking I'm all, I'm in the clear, I'm smiling, I'm listening to my music, we get to my school. Now, we get to the school. She puts the parking brake on, opens the doors, and then stops everyone in the aisle. She's like, I want to talk to you guys about something, and so does my friend. And then, as I hear her say my friend, I kind of hear, like, stepping up onto the bus, and I hear a radio go off, like a police radio. And I'm like, fuck. So the cop looks over everyone on the bus, and he's like, hi, so did any of you leave this here? And he pulls the little baggie out from his shirt pocket, and he holds it in front of everyone in the bus. He's like, so, did any of you leave it? Did you leave it? And he points at me, and I'm like, no, officer, I didn't leave that there. And he's like, are you sure? Because you're sitting in the same seat we found it in. And I'm like, no, I promise. I, I wasn't, you know, I, I'm good. I don't have anything on me. You can search me right now. And he's like, all right, well, good. Well, I'm just here to let you guys know, this is a public school where people come to learn. This isn't where you can come and sit around and do drugs. So go get your asses in that building and learn. And he just steps off the bus. And he walks away, and he goes into the principal's office and does whatever he has to do. I'm, like, freaking out. My heart just... Th 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 I'm, like, fucking freaking out, guys. And I'm just like, oh, my God. If I would have just, like... If he would have came over and looked and, like... I'm sure there was crumbs, like, little shakes in my bag of weed. And uh, I'm sure he could have looked at my backpack and, like... I don't know. I'm stuttering right now because I can't even go back to that experience and think about how scared I was. So the bus driver then looks at us and goes, seriously, this isn't a, this is a bus. This is where we get you to and from school. You're not supposed to be bringing your drugs on here. We can get in serious trouble for that. And everyone's like, yeah, we know we're sorry. And then we all just got off and we went about our day. Everything was fine. I am so lucky I didn't get caught. I can't even explain 
like I said, guys, it's just, I hope you guys never have to deal with the situations that I'm in because it's just really a terrifying experience. But, um, my friend's a dick. I'm never talking to that kid again. I'm just kidding, but he's an asshole. And I'm not helping him anymore because he couldn't help me. He could have easily picked up my weed and got it for me, but whatever. At least I didn't get caught, guys. Moral of the story is don't buy or do drugs at school. Just stay off it. Just, oh my God. But, um, anyway, guys, um, I have a double upload going up today. And um, it's relating to my school. I'm actually out of school now. I'm completely done for the year. I got kind of kicked out, kind of. I, I don't know, guys. Just watch the upload in a few hours. But anyway, guys, this has been Austin FFA or Luna. I hope you guys did enjoy. Peace.